How to fix Plex playback error on Windows. This video guide will cover the following Plex error codes, an error occurred trying to play the video. Conversion failed. The transcoder exited due to an error. Playback error. An error occurred loading items to play. Please check that the file exists and the necessary drive is mounted. Playback error. This server is not powerful enough to convert video. Unexpected playback problem, Plex app not working on TV. 1. An error occurred trying to play the video. Here are some suggestions that may help resolve the issue, check if Plex Media Server is running and accessible. Restart the server if needed. Make sure the file format of the video is supported by Plex. Common supported formats include MP4, MKV, AVI. Plex may not be able to play uncommon or proprietary formats. If the video plays partially but then errors out, it could be a network connectivity issue. Try playing the video locally on the server if possible as a test. Make sure remote access is configured properly. Check if the video codec is supported. Plex may not be able to handle certain video codecs like HEVC slash H.265 without a Plex Pass subscription. Look at the Plex logs for any error message details, locate logs under server settings. Google the error text for solutions. Try optimizing or transcoding the video if available as an option. This may resolve codec or transfer problems. Update Plex Media Server and client applications to latest versions if possible. Newer versions may have better codec support. As a last resort, you can try reinstalling Plex. Back up the Plex Media Server data first if you go this route. Plan B, run the following commands as admin, copy complexapp.plugins.library.db. complexapp.plugins.library.db.original slide 3 complexapp.plugins.library.db. Drop index index underscore title underscore sort underscore natural sort slide 3 complexapp.plugins.library.db. Delete from schema underscore migrations where version equals 20180501000000 slide 3 complexapp.plugins.library.db. Dot dump. Dump.sql del complex app.plugins.library.db. Slide 3 complex app.plugins.library.db. Dump.sql complex app.plugins.library.db shm. Complex app.plugins.library.db wall. Reboot your device. 2. Conversion failed. The transcoder exited due to an error. That conversion failed error in Plex usually indicates there was a problem transcoding the video file. A few things to try. Check the Plex server transcoder settings and adjust if needed. Sometimes limiting the maximum transcoder video quality can help resolve errors. Make sure the Plex server has enough CPU and RAM resources to handle transcoding. Video transcoding takes a lot of processing power. Try playing the file directly without transcoding if possible. For remote playback, adjust quality settings on the client to original and disable transcoding. If transcoding is necessary, optimize the video file for Plex using the built-in optimization tools. This will pre-process it into a format Plex can handle more easily. As a workaround, you can try converting the video to a more compatible format using Handbrake or other video encoding software. Then replace file in Plex library. Check if the video codec is supported by Plex. Current versions may not be able to transcode HEVC slash H.265, for example. Update Plex server and client if possible, newer versions may contain transcoding fixes. Review Plex logs for any details on the transcoder error during the conversion failure. Other tips, update Plex player. Save your file in a different location rather than C colon backslash program files, x86, folder. 3. Playback error. An error occurred loading items to play. That an error occurred loading items to play a message in Plex usually indicates a problem retrieving and loading the media content for playback. Here are some troubleshooting steps to try, restart the Plex media server if you haven't already, this can clear up cache and connectivity issues. Check the network connection between the Plex server and client device. Try playing content locally on the server as a test. Make sure the file itself plays properly outside of Plex. The file could be corrupted or have an unsupported format. On the Plex client, empty the playback queue and restart the app. Try adding the item to play again. If playing remotely, the server may be struggling to stream to the client. Lower remote streaming quality in server and client settings. Refresh metadata for the movie slash episode by going into get info and clicking refresh. Check if there are any errors or helpful messages in the Plex media server logs. Try scanning and cleaning bundles for the library content. As a last resort, delete and re-add the movie slash show to the Plex library to rebuild from scratch. If you continue to get the playback error, check the Plex forums or contact Plex support to see if it's a known issue. Providing logs and specifics around when the error occurs can help troubleshoot further. Plan B, change the transcoder quality to automatic for transcoder. 4. Please check that the file exists and the necessary drive is mounted. That check that the file exists error in Plex typically means the Plex media server is unable to find or access the video file you are trying to play. Here are some things to check on that, confirm the file is present at the expected location on the Plex server. If files have been moved or deleted outside of Plex, it will give this error. If playing from a mounted network drive, verify the connection is active and valid. Restart the network drive if needed. Check the permissions on the folder and file. Plex may not have read access to play the video. 
Rescan the library folder in Plex to refresh the content. This will re-index any new files. Look at the file name and path for any special characters that could confuse Plex. Rename if needed. Try moving the file to a local drive on the Plex server rather than a network mount. View the logs during the playback. File. Identify the exact path it is trying to access. As a last resort, delete and re-add the movie slash show to the Plex library to completely rebuild the entry. If the file is definitely there and playable outside of Plex, you may need to adjust permissions, drive mounts, or scan your folders to refresh the Plex library. Checking the exact path in the logs can help pinpoint the issue. 5. Playback error. This server is not powerful enough to convert video. That not powerful enough playback error in Plex indicates the Plex media server is struggling to transcode the video file into a format your client device can play. Here are some tips to improve transcoding performance, lower the remote streaming quality in Plex server and client settings. This will reduce the transcoding resolution and bandwidth. Enable video transcoding in Make My CPU Hurt mode under Plex Settings Transcoder. This maximizes resources for transcoding. Close any other intensive apps running on the Plex server to free up CPU and RAM for transcoding. Check the video codec and resolution, HEVC, 4K, etc. may be too difficult to transcode with your hardware. Direct play these files instead of transcoding if possible. Set the client quality to maximum when playing media locally. This avoids unnecessary transcoding. If hardware allows, enable GPU transcoding in Plex settings to improve performance. Consider upgrading the CPU or adding a dedicated graphics card to your Plex server if needed. Transcoding takes a lot of processing power. As a last resort, you can convert the video to a more compatible format with Handbrake prior to adding to Plex. The goal is to reduce transcoding requirements and improve server capabilities. Check the Plex dashboard during playback to see if transcoding load is the issue. Other tips, lower the streaming quality from 4K to, maybe, 1440p or 1080p. Disable use hardware acceleration when available in advanced transcoder settings. Unexpected playback problem, Plex app not working on TV.